Okay guys, so I am here in the village I grew up in and Jax is in Sweden with her family for Christmas. I came to my mom's place and now I'm gonna go over to our to my old neighbor, to my mom's neighbor um, because he is actually making something essential for our apartment, for Casa Cozy. We haven't seen anything yet. Um, we've just been talking on the phone. I mean, I was over yesterday and peeked into his workshop and saw a little bit through the window and it looked absolutely incredible already. I'm just gonna meet him, we're gonna talk about over things. I mean, of course, he ran into com some complications. Here we are at my place. Introducing our pet. Her name is Tina. How many hours did you? How many hours uh, did you spend on this project? Fifty something. Fifty hours. With all drum and dran. Keine Ahnung. Muss ich halt auf Englisch machen? Das kann ja auch nicht sein. Kopf einer. Wir können auch hier. Here we go. Heiner's. Heiner's magic place. Okay, guys. This is the moment. Look at that. Mmm, the smell. It smells like steel and weld. So, uh, as you might have. Uh, figured out uh, Hannah's making our big uh, steel glass wall and these are the first two elements uh, and they look really really uh, amazing I'm very happy they have to fit through the stairways and let's let's <laughs> let's hope they fit in the stairs if not Hannah has a backup plan which is uh, a little lift like a little rope Outside. we yeah. rope it up we rope it up in the back of the house Weil der hat hier ein anderes Profil, hier siehst du hier, ne? der ist ja so ein bisschen schräg und der ist genau rechtwinklig hier. Und dann sind die verschieden dick. Ja. Das, ist, das ist ja von Anfang an, das hat mich natürlich am Anfang genervt. It looks very advanced. I have to say. Und die müssen halt tatsächlich auf einen Millimeter ungefähr passen. Ne? To fit millimeter accurate. Da wird halt jetzt hier immer, das dann hier so. So the idea is to prepare the welding and to kind of take some of the steel away so that the seam of the welding actually can have space fit in. Absolutely phenomenal. No, yeah. It's really nice. Ey. It sieht auch geil aus. Richtig nice. Ey. Der Heiner ist drauf. They are much lighter than uh, expected, which is a good thing because um, be. this guy over there is already finished. Three meter 30 high. That's about as high as our ceiling is. In Berlin, in the process of planning this whole thing, we of course had to consider the, the size of the wall, which is 3 meter 40 ceiling and 480 width. We have about 1 meter wide fields here. Four of those. And we connect them with bolts. So these are the guys that will hold yeah. the elements together later. I am really impressed. Happy also with the outcome of the sizes of the fields. Yeah. If you have Heiner there, I as try a to, to make some other dimensions, but this is the only. This is a good dimension, yeah. I guess tomorrow we might stand them up and just look how they look. Also, love the the, the 40 millimeter steel. It, it doesn't look too bulky, too heavy. Heiner has been thinking about the, the, the thickness a lot. So, of course, if you go thicker, you have more stability, but it gets much more heavy. And can Oh, yeah. Oh, God. Beautiful. But yeah, I love it. They look, they, they sehen meisterhaft aus. It looks masteresque. Absolutely. Do you have a master actually? <laughs> Doing it my whole life. Of course. Really, really nice work, I have to say. Wow. Tomorrow we'll do some more further uh, testing and, and putting up some stuff and so on. It is the 26th of December, two days after Christmas. Going back over to Heiner's to get some action shots and see what he's up to. Maybe stand up a piece of the wall. Morning! The work base is actually built exactly on millimeter, how every frame has to be so that every frame is equal. So, jetzt kann das schon nicht mehr wegwandern. 
Schweiß ich als nächstes mal hier fallen hätte, dann mache ich damit ein Schutzgasgerät. Ne? So, this was pinning the frame together. Einer ist gonna make the bars that go in here, pin them in and then do the proper welding. Ausgeschlissen. Muss hier unten noch ein bisschen dicker weggeschliffen werden, ne? Siehst du ja. Uh, guys, should we put out one of those and just... Let's do it, I'm curious. Well, that is from jetzt Bombe, ne? Okay, this is the size. It looks very cool. Basti? Yeah. Yeah. Oder kannst du mal filmen? Ich kann filmen, ja. That is a high wall, dude. Von der Dimension her? Perfect. <laughs> yeah, ich so, find... Super geil! Hammer! That is einfach die optimale Größe so vom Fenster. It's perfect. Einer. Also, I'm very impressed. It's actually exactly how it should be. Great dimensions. Yeah, this is very high. The whole village is here. And then we're gonna have a door that's gonna be a sliding door, which will be three fields wide. So, like this wide. And only four high. The door goes all the way like this. This is four fields wide. Our wall will be nine fields wide. So, more or less until here. Every glass piece is going to be slightly smaller. Kit it in, glue it in. Size. Ja, ich bin ja Werkzeugmacher. Werkzeugmacher heißt, ich baue eigentlich sonst Werkzeuge oder Vorrichtung. So this is the door. Und das macht die the door edge. Ja, so und damit das hier steif ist, ne, wo die. Yes. Because the door is going to be pretty heavy. Wenn du hier guckst, ne, wenn das. So this is the 12 mm round steel uh, Heiner's posts. Uh, to make the door handle out of this, which will be attached here and go on the big door. So looks really cool standing out there. Nice. So guys, this was my little video about the making of our glass steel wall. Heiner is doing an incredible job. I'm very excited. Can't wait to put it up. January is going to be the month we put the wall up and it's going to change a whole lot inside Casa Cozy. Anyway. Uh, see you soon and yeah, wish you all a happy new year! Bye!